<laughs> We're off! Oh. We're off to Cochrane and I don't know where else are we going? <laughs> I'm gonna get my beads. For What's real? That? How come those guys run out of taste fast? The gum? Yeah. Like they are good, but the other ones are better. The ones that are in balls. They come from <laughs> apple. Those are the kind that... Those, those last longer, yeah. but they do still run out. I, th I, I think lettuce. those ones are more sweeter. Yeah, they are. These yeah. ones are like, not that sweet. That's why I like these ones. So we are off to... Calgary? Calgary, I guess. Yeah, we got up early, so we can go do some stuff before work again. Been doing that for the past two months, getting the room. Because work sucks. I yeah. work late, so I can't do anything. I can't enjoy my evening. It's like really nice to have It's like really nice to have a job but there's like good things that come with it and then there's like bad things that come with it The bad thing is that it takes a lot of your time that is needed to do things that don't even have anything to do with work. <laughs> like for him, he needs to record. Write down some ideas. Got a lot float through my head. And then I'm supposed to be beating, like hardcore beating. I have to take one stitch when I'm done. A couple songs. Well, it's a race. Oh my god. Okay, this is a race now. <laughs> Competition. <laughs> you will see. I will have With our beaded stuff done before Last Bridge Power. What are you gonna get done before Last Bridge Power? An elbow? My arms are already getting tired. Your arm. Here are you holding it. Over there. Whoa. This is illegal driving. Oh my god. Pronounce <laughs> <laughs> Donald Smith, you're so wrong. I'm picking up my beads, my two kilos of beads, eggshell color for our outfits. Wish me luck. Here. Beads. So, yeah, guess he's gonna buy some beads. She goes. Off she goes. Now she went in. I lost my iPod. I can't listen to my jams. I don't have an iPhone. Because we don't have a phone, we will <laughs> later in time. 
So I'm listening to a. Uh, there you go. I'm listening to that. When there's nothing on good on the radio. Always go to Country 105. Calgary. FM. Good station. So, other than radio and beads, do you guys want to check out some ghetto glasses? This is what I've been wearing since, well, a little quick story on my glasses journey. I had these glasses probably since 2011. Back in 2013, I had some uh, new ones, like, I got re retest and apparently my vision got a bit better, so I got had to get new glasses. And I went to a powwow, but down in uh, Montana. Oh, I think it was uh, Missoula, Montana. Yes. And then I, th I left it there. <laughs> I leave things with without knowing or remembering. I left it there, but I guess these are the glasses that I'm talking about back in 2011 and 10 that I had. And I'm still wearing, but it's all busted now. Rubber's all gone. Going commando. Uh, kind of scratched up, which is. I mean, I can still see. It's still good. So, I don't wear it during the day. That's why I go solo. Uh, let's check out my glasses. Okay. We got electric tape on the right side, <laughs> no padding for the ear, ear bone. In the middle is kind of uh, busticated, so I mean, as long as it holds, it's really good. No, no, no padding or rubber. And then there's a couple scratches on the lenses. Like right in the middle. <laughs> uh, my buddy, Timmy, <laughs> was uh, trying all my glasses and he told me, how do you see in these, man? It's like right in the middle. I told him, yeah, it's kind of hard. And uh, left side's actually still pretty good, so that's where I put put it in my pocket I mean it can't really bend on this side so it's okay I guess but uh yeah my little glasses journey and right now we're still waiting for Janine so let's wait so it looks like Sad news. No beads. Beads. Bad news, honey. I'm sad and I'm mad at the same time. Why? Because I specifically told her to order size 10 and she ordered size 11 again. So I got my money back. It was the same color. Hey. What size 11? But I told her like how many times that I wanted size 10. So. And then I was like, um, well, I might as well just 
you know, get the beads where I originally got because I gave her that sample, right? Yeah. And I was like, the the company that I got the sample from, they have the same beads but cheaper. So I think I just want my money back. And so she looked real upset giving me my money back. And I was like, okay, well, it's your fault, you know? You. So I didn't get my two kilos of bone color in size 10. <laughs> Those are really hard to find and I'm never gonna find them. I'm so sad. Man, we would have been the only ones with that color. Oh. <laughs> Anyways, we're off to Calgary and uh, I just made my $100 back so we're $100 richer and we're gonna see what we can do with that. <laughs> FedEx. Oh, I just ran into the door. <laughs> she told me not to record down here, so I gotta record Is up it here. Recording? Yeah, it's recording. <laughs> this yeah. Is I will, don't worry. So we are here again at Northland. And we... We're gonna eat because we're so hungry. We're gonna get our thigh on. But uh, there's a lot here, so... Okay. Hold on. We're gonna eat, so... We'll be right back, we're gonna order. There it is, I told you. <coughs> Alrighty. Oh snap. Hey guys, so we're home now. Um I just wanted to show you what I bought. Um we went to Safeway and we went to Walmart. Uh at Safeway. <laughs> Chips. <laughs> I, love, I love salt and vinegar chips. Um, Americans don't know what these taste like, do they? They don't. I don't think they don't. But they're awesome. If you ever come to Canada, try these. Oh, and then we bought iTunes. And then I bought... These were actually cheaper at Safeway than Walmart because I looked in Walmart and there were six bucks in Safeway these were only four dollars so yeah and then uh, I wanted to go to Walmart and get my my pads <laughs> my Nuxzema pads because I ran out like, I've been using this for a really long time now, and it really works. And then, this caught my eye. This caught my eye because, um, I really need something like this to wipe off my makeup at the end of the day before we go to bed. Because I think that's the reason why I've been breaking out. But, um... I'm so lazy to just go wash my face before bedtime, so I figured, well, I should just leave this beside my bed <laughs> and then wipe my face before I go to sleep. And it says night calming. See? And then what else? I saw this, it was only like a dollar, and I was like, well, I need a new chapstick because um, the one I have ran out and the one from Nivea it, it doesn't work at all it's not good but I bought this it's like and I already opened it I already tried it because I really needed it and 
it's really awesome. I like it. It tastes good. Good job. Oh, and um, I want a free microwavable popcorn bag thingy at Safeway. That's all I bought. Well, we bought pop. I bought 7-Up for myself, trying to cut down on some coke, so I bought 7-Up. And Brayden bought himself Dr. Pepper, because he loves Dr. Pepper. And that's pretty much it. That's all. And now, um, I'm going to go to the flea market. I probably dropped Brayden off at work. And I have some earrings to go and sell to this young lady that she wanted my earrings so yeah you can go check it out there see how it goes it's pretty busy too bad I'm not there today selling my stuff so sad so um I didn't go to the flea market just yet. Brayden went to work, but he told me to look for his iPod. So I think I'll do that before I go. Uh, it's so cold outside. But uh, I was thinking of looking on the snow because that's possibly where we could have dropped it. You know, oh, my God, there's my gum. Shiloh, where's the iPod? Where's the iPod, Shiloh? We lost the iPod. Oh, it's so cold outside. Oh, man. What's it under there? I don't know how far an iPod can go, but I think we totally lost it. We totally lost it, Shallow. Where is it? Oh yeah, good news. We charged the truck battery, so it's running now. Shallow, the camera's not food. Quit trying to grab it. I don't know. I think this iPod is playing tricks with us. Like, you know what they say, like, natives, the little people, they're playing tricks with you. <laughs> I think that's what's happening. So, um, no luck in finding the iPod outside. So sad. But um, I'm thinking um, that we're just gonna buy a new iPod since we have money right now and plus pretty sure Brayden's payday is tomorrow. His first payday. So we can definitely buy a new iPod. But uh, I found his toque. He said that he lost his toque as well. But I found his toque. <laughs> but yeah. Um, so I know I said I was going to go to the flea market. But I'm not. Because. Um, the, the girl that wanted to buy the earrings. She rescheduled for another day. Because. 
She said that she really needed something, so she's going to use her money for that. And I totally understand because earrings is kind of like a, you know, it's a want. But when it comes to needs, like, you should spend your money on your needs instead of your wants. I'm pretty sure she doesn't need earrings to make her life whole better, you know. <laughs> But, um, yeah, so next Wednesday I'm going to meet up with her and I'll show you the earrings that she's going to be buying. So I made those. But yeah, um... So she's going to buy those on Wednesday, including um, Audrey Hepburn earrings. I should show you those two as well. They're not finished. But, um... I was talking to her if she liked those colors um, and she said that she she didn't know about the colors and I told her I didn't know about them either just kidding uh, I guess we're both not sure that we want those colors so I told her well I can just you know put different colors on I don't mind remaking it because you know I want to like it as well and I want her to like it so I'm just gonna redo that earring so it's gonna look different. I'll show you guys later. 